What's up guys, Putty here and welcome back for another episode of Red Dead Redemption. This is part of the Red Dead Redemption finishing the game marathon, at least I hope so. Anyway, in the last episode we helped Abraham Reyes rob a train, like we needed another train mission in Mexico. And in this episode we're heading back to Luisa for our last Luisa mission. And um, this, <laughs> this mission's name is quite spoiler-tastic, so I guess if you don't want to hear a spoiler, skip ahead... I don't know, a couple of seconds. Actually, I'll tell you exactly when you should skip ahead, because, uh... uh I don't know, it's weird. I mean, this guy... I'm sure a lot of you have played this game, you know what's going on. Uh, it's not even a massive spoiler, it's not even something we really care about. But for me, it's just a bit weird how the quest name kind of gives away the quest. But, who knows, maybe you guys don't really care. Anyway, let's uh, just keep on right into Campa Mirada, I believe, is where Luisa hangs out most of the time. Um, that's our home, I think, actually. It's less of a camp, but more of a random shack. But, um, we won't criticize. We won't criticize the visionary's girlfriend. Lover, mistress, wife, fiancé. Can't really tell at this point. No, not helping you. Whore. Don't know who you are. Don't care. Um, God, we're turning into Marshall in this Bioshock series here. No, I'm joking. Anyway, come on. Let's keep riding. Well, yeah. Now we say Marshall, this horse is called Marshall, at least I think it is. Or was that the white one? I can't remember. God damn it. Going through a lot of points here. Is this Campo Morada? Wait, this is Campo Morada. The thing that got burnt down. Anyway, I guess Louisa isn't that Campo Morada. Come on, god damn it. Oh, is that Campo Mar No, that's not Campo. Oh, whatever. Anyway, if you would like to avoid spoilers, skip ahead. 15. Just look in the little YouTube preview thing and wait until the loading screen is over. Um. Okay, so, again, if you want to, oh, also you need to mute the video if you're, if you're gonna avoid spoilers, you can't just not look at it, because I'm gonna, I'm gonna say the name of the quest, alright? So, if you want to avoid spoilers, skip ahead. Father Abraham? I've got this wrong. You want trouble, friend? Manos arriba. Atilas. Tranquilo. Tranquilo, amigo. Tranquilo. Ya lo tengo. Move ese cabrón. Arce. Muy difícil. Tenemos que jugarlo bien. Ah, oh, Mr. Marston, I knew you would come. Thanks for the welcoming committee. I'm sorry, we cannot be too careful. The world is very dangerous. Especially when you greet it with a gun. Please. Mr. Marston, my father was killed yesterday. The army found him and accused him of treason. They cut out his heart and fed it to their dogs. He ended with this. Then he took the honor of two young girls. I'm sorry to hear that, Louisa. My father must not die in vain. His death must mean something. It'll mean that war is brutal and unnecessary and good people die. And that's all it will mean. That is not enough. You know I'll do whatever I can, but I have problems of my own. We all have problems. This is about the people. My father died for his people. For these men and for millions like them, that they may be free. While there are guns and money, there won't be any freedom, Louisa. Mr. Marston, the movement is on the brink of great victory. Allende knows this and has sent for reinforcements. Abram Reyes asked personally that you stop them reaching Escalera. They are coming by the old trail. You must ambush them. I have my own family to worry about. Mr. Marston, I have lost my father. My mother is in the United States. My sister has fled. I have no family. Just because. Please. Good actions make you a good man. Then I'm doomed. But I will help you. Out of respect for your loss. 
Thank you, Mrs. Watson. Thank you. Hmm. Let's go. We do not have much time to prepare the ambush. I was thinking of the next quest. God damn, I totally got this mixed up. I missed a quest in my little notes. I, horse, I completely missed this quest. Um, so I guess there's five quests left, left instead of four. Well, now there's four instead of three, but still. I missed a quest. I can't believe that. My research is awful. Is it... I can't believe I, I missed a quest. I thought this was a different quest. Sorry about your Sorry. father. His death must not be in vain. Now we shall fight even harder to win power for Abraham. I admire your devotion. He is a true revolutionary. A man who puts the needs of others before his own. A man who fights out of love rather than hate. But you know this already. I heard about the battle at Chubarosa. How he killed nearly a hundred soldiers to save your life. It'll go down in legend. I'm sure of that. Can I trust you, Mr. Marston? In what way? You have done so much for me and my family, but I still can't forgive you for helping again for what you did to the rebels. I'm here for two men, that's it. Not to take sides. And certainly not to fight a war that isn't mine. It makes no sense. You make a choice by not making a choice, you know. Alinde betrayed me. I saw him do bad things. Things that disgust even me. Allende is pura maldad. One day I will cut his heart out. But me, you, him, we're all shooting people. Don't really seem like we're so very different. The difference is why, Mr. Marcy. The ideals we hold, there can never be revolution without blood. Until people forget what they're shooting for, and just enjoy killing for its own sake. You Americans forget too quickly. That is the problem. If it wasn't for your revolution, we would still be making tea for the English. At least we knew where we stood. It's more difficult to understand why your own people treat you like shit. It is the same here. We fought off the Spanish. We fought off the French. We even fought off the Americans. Finally, Mexico won its independence. And all we've done since then is fight each other. At least you're keeping up tradition. It will end when Abraham takes control. When the Spanish left, we renamed this province Nuevo Paraíso. New Paradise. One day, it will live up to its name. You keep thinking that, Luisa. You keep thinking that. Why do you doubt a revolution so much, Mr. Marston? I guess I can't pretend to understand your country's politics. But you think we are fighting for nothing? Take no notice of me. I ain't got much faith in power just now. That is exactly why we must continue to fight for change. Nothing ever really changes. You are a man who has lost his spirit. No doubt. I once believed it was possible to make a difference. The men I'm chasing, they did too. That if we spilled enough blood, we could change the way people think. Revolutions are always won with blood. And after the fighting's done? Freedom. We ain't never free. Be honest with yourself, and you will be free. That must be what I've been getting wrong all these years. childhood than what we had. Guess I failed that. What is his name? Jack. Jack Marston. I ain't been much of a father. So we had the daughter that died. It is not far now. The army convoy will be coming from the east. We're going to steal their supplies? No. Destroy them and kill everyone. Abraham wants to send a message. You have experience with explosives. A little. It's been a long time. Good, because we do not. You will man the detonator. My men are waiting there for us. They will also need your help setting up the dynamite. I'll do my best. 
We will do this for my father, John. There they are. We're doing everything? These men will help you rig dynamite on the road. Please tell them where to place it. I'll be waiting up above, watching for the wagon. Okay, follow me, gentlemen. Vale, where do you want it? Okay. Uh, okay. So, why I can place them wherever I want. Okay. Um, Alright, I don't know how big this convoy is going to be. But, we'll see there. That may cause a chain reaction, you know? Isn't that the point? Here. Oh. Okay. There you go. Here's good. Really? I thought I had five to plant. I don't know. Guess I wasn't gonna destroy most of the convoy anyway. Don't hear them. The last one here. Go meet Luis at the detonator. We will handle the rest. Sure. Go to the detonator on the hill. I don't think this is going to turn out too good. It's been a while. Unless I get to choose when I get to blow it up. If that's the case, then I'll probably be able to get them all. But uh, if I don't get to choose, then it'll probably just all blow up. Oh well. Louisa! Oh, they're coming from that direction. They are coming. Get ready, John. Hey. We will give them the surprises of their lives. I don't know about that. Wait, we were just in plain sight? Oh, I see. Cool. That'd be awesome if we could do that in real life. Here they come. Walking down the street. Gets the craziest looks. From everyone they meet. <laughs> Here they come. Come on. They don't suspect a thing. Yet. I've got a bad feeling about this. Alright, wait until they get over the first one. Wait until the carriage gets there. Oh. Wait, did I set up everyone? Ooh. Yeah! Good stuff. Okay, what are we going for now? Rolling block rifle? Sounds good to me. Shoot the wagon, goddammit. Killed one of the horses. Wait, we can't let them get away. Okay, we can't let that guy get away. God damn it. Come on, get over the train track, John. No! God damn it, I'm not cutting this out, god damn it. Oh, you're kidding me right now, right? Alright, fine. Here. Start here. Alright, start here. And then go there. You want them so close to each other. Yep. This is good. And then there. Another one here. Set the last one here. <laughs> I don't even give two shits. Alright, let's go. Luisa! Let's do this again, I guess. Sorry guys, not cutting this out this time because I'm really, it's a marathon, you know, you're gonna have to deal with having a little bit of uh, quantity over quality issues here. I'm sorry. It is my fault, but I don't care. Alright, just gotta wait for them to come around the corner. And, wait, I should leave the detonator, shouldn't I? I'll come back to the, wait, can I, yeah, I can ready it again. So if I just go like this, and start taking them out here. Okay, now ready to go. Alright. Come. Here they come. So let's just wait. Because the, 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 the wagons are going to try and get through. And when they do, Yeah! And I have one more left. When that wagon tries to run me. Run at me, wagon! Do it! Try to escape, you poor little thing. Bam! Okay, Louisa. 
We get it. You're a vengeful bitch. You know? We kind of got that from the beginning. Well, that worked much better this time. Thank you, Mr. Marston. We are a step closer to power. My father would be very proud. I hope it was worth it. I must return to Campo Mirada. Meet me there when you can. I will do my best to return the favor. Where's Luisa? Oh no! We don't have a quest! Oh no! Oh god, what are we to do? Oh, there it is. Oof! <laughs> I'm just kidding. Uh, I have no clue what to do with myself unless I see letters on the map to direct me in a certain way, location, thing. Oh god. Anyway, um, yeah. Um, this is actually the quest I was thinking of um, that we were supposed to do in this episode, but since we did Father Abraham instead, uh, we're gonna be doing this one now yeah uh so that one's actually gonna be the spoiler tactic quest name at least according to my notes which have been wrong before god i can't believe that anyway i hope you enjoyed this episode if you enjoyed please, please leave a thumbs up which really helps the video get out there as well as i'd like to see your comments if you have anything to say about the video please leave it in the comment section below i love reading them and check out the rest of my series. I've got a playlist on my channel and a few of the other episodes should appear to the right. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe if you're not already and I will see you guys next time.